Hello and welcome to today's video. My name is Jean, spelled like Jean. And I'm Samantha. And uh, it's my fiance. And in this video, we're gonna talk about our body fat results. We took a, or body fat, bone density. From our DEXA scan. From a DEXA scan. So be sure to stay tuned for that. But before that, here's a workout. Good morning. Are you ready for this? Yes, I am. The push-ups. I had to do hand release push-ups sometimes so I wouldn't be sitting around resting for that minute. <laughs> so this company Body Comp came to our gym and they have like a mobile setup inside of a van where you like lay down and there's like the scanner thing that scans your entire body. It takes like five, five minutes and it basically shoots out these results about like your weight, your bone density, and everything like that. What did you think about just the initial experience of doing it? Was that your first time doing it? Yeah, it was my first time doing it and I thought it was a lot of fun. <laughs> It was fun. Yeah. I like laid on it kind of weird, so my uh -huh. butt, my skeleton looks all. They kept on saying like, turn your head left, but your butt right, and I was just like, I don't think this in. is gonna be straight, <laughs> and it did not. Yeah, turn you up didn't straight. lay really still, and I've never done it before, so I was like, I need to do this perfectly to have the best results, and then they printed out our results, and then they told us everything. So. So I've always guessed that I was around 200 pounds, and it told me that I was 202 pounds. So I'm not terrified of that number. That number doesn't like scare me. It doesn't make me feel bad about myself. I'm, but I'm also like, I could be lighter, but I could be heavier. So I've got a body mass of 202 pounds, but 158 pounds of that is muscle. So that was pretty encouraging because I used to always think, oh, maybe I want to be around 180, 185, but I think that would just be too low. Like that would be, I would be like literally no body fat, which wouldn't be healthy, which wouldn't be good at all. Um, but that puts me at a body fat percentage of 17.8%. That's pretty good. Yeah. How did you feel about your weights and measurements? You don't have to say them. Well, my weight, a woman never reveals oh. her weight. But my body fat percentage was 33%, which I thought would was on the higher end. <laughs> but it is a ratio and I'm kind of a small human. And so my lean tissue was 85 pounds. And when the guy was like reading me my results, I was like, oh, that's pretty good. And then at the end, I was like, so what should I do with these results? And he was like, well, for someone your size and who's athletic and works out every day, I would try to aim for a body, the lean mass to be around 100 pounds. And I was like, oh, so what do you think I should be doing? And he was like, well, I don't think you should be doing a bunch of cardio, just like maintenance cardio, which is CrossFit, um, and maybe just like, work on gaining more lean muscle. I mean, he like didn't say maybe. It was like a definite like, you Whatever. need to build more muscle. <laughs> like you're too much, like for your height, you don't have enough muscle. Yeah, and I was kind of shocked because I was like, what? But but doesn't that kind of make sense? Like what's your like go-to thing when it's like, oh, I have an extra, you know, 30 minutes yeah. to do workouts, what do you do? So we you work always... out every single day and then I have to go to work. So it's either right after work or right before work. So if I do have extra time, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna go for a run, I'm gonna go for a walk, I'm gonna do cardio, like on the treadmill or something, and I always result to cardio. So then now I've been trying to fill my free time and do like, making an effort to make free time to do more weightlifting. 
and weightlifting, like bodybuilding, body just bro sesh build that muscle. And it's muscle. been really fun because I've never like. Done and that I've like in all the strength aspects, I've like kind of been pushing you like. Yes. Like I'm like, hey, you've done that weight before. Go heavier. Go yeah. heavier. You and then what happens is you end up like surprising yourself and do 200 pounds for five on hip thrusts. More than that. 235, right? <laughs> yeah. 235. Not so. That's a crazy strong hip thrust. I know. Yeah. So, it's so like we've been building kinda, that muscle. Yeah. So we've been kind of working on like progressive overload and like every exercise kind of focusing on like eight to 12 reps. And so I'll choose a weight and I'm like, oh, I'll probably do like eight of these, you know, eight reps. And I'll get to like 12 or 15 and I'm like, oh, I need to like increase the weight. Yeah. <laughs> Dark side is having an eight week challenge for either fat loss or lean muscle gain. And that's why we started with the DEXA scan. Because at the end of the eight weeks, we're gonna do the DEXA scan again and see how our body has changed. Yeah. You originally signed up for? The fat loss. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna do a bunch of cardio. I'm gonna restrict my calories. I got this, I'm used to this. Restrict, Healthy, yeah. healthily restrict. Yeah, like beat a deficit. Yeah. And then I increased my calories more than I was eating, but still in a deficit. Incorporated more weight training and I've already lost two pounds. Yeah, exactly. So you're, you're, like three weeks you increase your calories and you're losing weight because you're and because you're working heavy and you're building muscle. Yeah. Um, for me, I signed up for the uh, weight loss one, but I haven't done anything about it. And because like 200 pounds for me, like I'm not too worried about my physique. I don't care if people think I have a nice physique. I don't care um, if I, you know, take my shirt off and people are like, does he even work out? Like. I want to get stronger, <laughs> but I also want to increase my aerobic capacity and I want to get better at every aspect. And if my body isn't going to look a certain way in order for me to get there, that's fine. Like I'm currently running faster, finishing benchmark workouts faster and getting PRs on my back squat and all that stuff. So it's like, I'm totally happy where I am and it's not about physique. Now, if by building muscle with you, cause I'm doing her bodybuilding He's with doing her. doing everything that I'm doing. Yeah. If that means that I decrease my body fat percentage and I can land somewhere within the 15, 13 is what you hear as an athlete's body fat percentage, then that's cool. But again, it's not like this like thing that I like need to have. I'm just kind of like, yeah, if it happens, it happens. I'm not too worried about it. Try not to eat like an idiot. Like uh, that means like he won't get chips at Chipotle one day. <laughs> yeah, it means that I actually won't go to Chipotle one day instead of going there every single day. And I don't, I'll see that when I believe. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Among a lot of this stuff, I carry all my fat um, in my hips, which I already knew about. So, my hips and my butt is where I carry all my fat. <laughs> my legs are, like, the guys were like, how much you weigh? Well, you have so much muscle mass. Like, they're like, bro, if we had the same muscle mass in our legs that you do, we could squat so much. It was just like, <laughs> totally like, that's kind of like, they're like, because they do it all the time. It's kind of funny how they're like, man, I, if I had that muscle mass, I'd squat yeah. like that. And so it was kind of a cool thing, but my arms are exactly the same size on both sides, which they're like, that's, that's really idea. weird. Um, they say that's not very common. Um, but then also like part of like doing CrossFit, like everyone's bone density in the gym was like way lower than their average. And that's part of the of metabolic conditioning at a, at a high intensity with heavy weight is your boat. You do have like, it's all about, it, it builds your bones. It builds your body. Yeah. And so one of the things they said outside when, after they did everyone, they were just like, all y'all's bone density is just insane. Yeah, there was like a few older people at the gym and they were kind of worried, like, I'm hoping like my bones are okay. And they were like, perfect. <laughs> yeah. So all in all, like I'm, I feel really good about it. Um, in a couple weeks when we do our re want, redo, I'll let you, we'll let you guys know how our results yeah. are, but anything you want to leave them with? I'm just really excited to see like how my body transforms doing something totally different I'm not used to. I'm really excited to see how much muscle we build. Yeah. I think it'll be cool. All right, guys. If you enjoyed this video, uh, be sure to give it a like. Subscribe if you're not already subscribed. And we'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.